you see this kind of data it is directly taken from the field it has not been processed they are randomly placed they are not arranged also they do not show any kind of pattern right now i have not analyzed this and this is in the natural form so this is raw data on the contrary when i arrange this raw data they are called array how do i arrange i can arrange them in ascending form for example i can arrange them like 5 6 9 10 25 30 40 90 and 100 so they are increasing from so smallest to here they reach the largest so this is an array okay now next question is how to take out the frequency of any raw data now what is frequency frequency is just we want to know how many students frequency means how many times something is occurring so here if we want to know how many students are receiving pocket money above rupees 50 if this is the question the question is how many students are receiving pocket money short form pocket money above rupees 50 if i want to know that i have to convert them into groups first and then only i can know how many of the students fall in each group so first i have to convert them into group for that let me take consider here two groups say 0 to rupees 50 first group second group say 50 to 100 now what is the unit of this numbers these numbers what is the unit you see this is group this group is coming from this data the unit of this data is pocket money pocket money is what rupees so the unit of this is rupees so now we want to know the frequency that means 0 to 50 rupees is received by how many students here how many students have received 0 to 50 rupees see rupees 10 is less than 50 25 less than 50 less than 50 less than 50 so how many student 1 2 3 4 5 6 student have received pocket money ranging in this group 0 to rupees 50 now the second group is how many students have received pocket money above rupees 50 that is 50 to maximum number is rupees 100 you have to stop here 100 so how many of students have received pocket money ranging rupees 50 to 100 is 1 2 3 so it is 3 now technically you see what your frequency is correct or not you can cross check how now the data here is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 9 9 students so if your frequency for the first group is 6 and second group is 3 they both should add to make 9 student because that is the total number of students So six nine, they both add up to nine. So yes, your frequency is correct. I'm clear. Now the next question is, what is group data? Group data is when we group these raw data, just like this here. there are two groups so when we do any kind of uh, the work on the data first we have to group them and that process is known as group data so here this is a group data on the contrary what is ungrouped data the data which is not grouped like like what like that of the raw data here so this is not grouped this is ungrouped data and this is this is group data so this is the difference between the two now here i forgot to tell you one thing this groups individual groups like we call this frequency we call this class 
बाउंड्री आई विल आई विल कम लेटर अबाउट द डिटेल्स ऑफ हाउ फ्रीक्वेंसी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन टेबल इज मेड बट फर्स्ट दिस इज द बेसिक कॉन्सेप्ट दैट यू शुड नो